a really easy side dish this uh, holiday season, here's a good one to try out. It's a cider, gla cider glazed carrots. For today's recipe, you'll need nine cups carrots julienned, you'll need some butter, parsley, dried mustard, paprika, salt, celery seed, some cider vinegar, brown sugar, and some water. And we're just very simply going to start out with a whole bunch of julienned carrots. We need nine cups for this recipe, so it does give you a lot of uh, produce. So if you're serving a large group, this is a really good one. Uh, we did get a few bags of the already julienned carrots, and you can always do that. However, a lot of people are looking to cut back this year, and so this is another one that you can really get a lot of bang for your buck. Carrots aren't very expensive. Just peel them up if you have a food processor. They're really easy to julienne, and so we're gonna just julienne some of these carrots and get those started. Now that we have all of our carrots, we're ready to start with our recipe. And basically this is so easy. This is one of those recipes you can do very quickly. Uh, you can get your carrots all done up uh, the night before and then put these on uh, before uh, lunch the big day. We're gonna put our carrots in a large sauce pot and we're gonna put in just a little bit of water and we're gonna let those uh, cook until they're tender. Now remember, they're julienned. Oop, I already got my pot hot. They're julienned, so they won't take a lot of time to cook, but we do wanna make sure that they're somewhat tender before we start adding in all of our other ingredients. And you can see it's a pot full. You know, the great thing about carrots is that they are very high in vitamin A. They're very low fat. In fact, a half a cup of carrots is only about uh, four calories and so they're very low calorie and notice we're not putting just a whole lot of water in here we're not going to really boil as much as we are uh, steam so we're going to get that all together put our lid on and let it work its magic we're ready to continue our recipe by just adding in the rest of our ingredients we've got about a tablespoon of margarine about a quarter of a teaspoon of salt, some dried mustard and paprika, about half a teaspoon each of those, half a teaspoon of our celery seed, two tablespoons of our cider vinegar, and then a quarter of a cup of packed brown sugar. And you just dump all of that in there. And then we're just gonna stir this around until all of our carrots are really evenly coated and all of those good ingredients are distributed throughout the carrots. At this point, we just put, uh, let it cook for about two or three more minutes, just so that you get those flavors to blend and you get uh, all of your carrots nice and coated. And then our final step is just to add in a little bit of chopped parsley. You know, like I said, people are really looking for uh, some new side dishes for their holidays this year, and this can be a great one. Really, uh, lots of nutrition, lots of color, and the great thing about it is it is low cost because we don't have a lot of uh, really tricky ingredients or in great amounts. Uh, once you take out any of those cream soups or processed cheeses, our recipes can really be lower in cost. Great thing is, they're also higher in nutrition. You can see this is a great colorful dish to add to your holiday table. It makes 12 servings and each one is only 64 calories. So this is a great side dish to pair with some of our old favorites. Gives your table some color and a little nutrition too. Hope you have happy holidays this season. Be sure to come back to the Food Corner, part of Newstar.com, for more demonstrations and recipes. And if you have any questions, contact the Pottawatomie County OSU Extension Office. We'd like to send a great thanks to Rock Creek Baptist Church for letting us use their facilities today. And remember, eat better, eat together.